Ladies and gentlemen, we are back at our town that we're building over here by our Durberger gas station and not so pleasant motel. I changed this from uh, from last night. Got rid of the, uh, there was a bush that was here. Got rid of that. Uh, moved the signage here. Put in some berries. I fixed the, uh, pretty much the road or asphalt, whatever you want to call this. Look all the way around. So that this is done as long as, as well as the, uh, the white striping. I extended this, made that decision, extended that. So now we just have a walkway right through here. It's good. Gave them a fireplace in the back corner. I'm going to make that into a small little, uh, fire pit for them. That's what I decided with that space. That's pretty much done. All we need to do is just fill in the uh, rooms. Let's see. Added some lighting up here. Added lighting inside of this. Haven't added anything new yet, and I'm pretty sure I'm going to. Uh, let's see. We made that. Went up two more higher with here to accommodate larger vehicles. This is where our wider vehicles can go as well. And then I went up... I uh, already told you, I went up twice with this, but... But now we are working on the parking space, and I'm ready to add a uh, blueprint. I said I was going to add it, add a blueprint in here. I decided with this one, but I want it to go this way. It says it will go right up against that, but sometimes after you drop it, it won't. <laughs> Do I want it that way? No, I want it this way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, this way it won't. It's going to turn red on me. So in order to fix that, we have to get... Oh, I know why. Over here. I get rid of this. So let's do that for now. The road isn't going to be... The road is going to accommodate small vehicles, pretty much, guys. And actually... Jax has another small little RC car that I think would look really nice in here, too. Might change some things on it, but... Watch another video. He's killing it right now. In my opinion with vehicles. Um, let's see. Can we go all the way? Let's try it. We can't block. This is the other thing, too. I'm trying to make sure I don't block the road. Need to make sure... Did I eyeball that right? Ooh. I did not. Almost. But it fit right up against this, which is what I wanted. Hmm. Let's move it. All right, let me take this out and bring, bring it back in, all right?
Oh, the finishing piece, no? Oh, no, we're out of planks and rods. All right, hang on. Uh, let's see, rods are in here. Any more planks than that? See if we can build it from down here. I mean, actually, let's go up there. I want to take out those stairs because then I want to take a step back. Close the door behind you, T. Don't want Mrs. Dizzle to get mad. You can take care of this. Flagship restaurant. All right. That might be the title of this video. Let's go all the way up top. Oh, yeah, guys. Man, does this look nice. I got to finish that sign. I didn't do that yet. Guys, and we're not even done yet. Yeah, I got to finish the road, the logistics of the road. Let's finish this parking space right here. So this worked out perfect because originally I was building this for the gas station, but we could this is can be used for the uh the, the uh, flagship restaurant as well. Hmm. It's not gonna let us go all the way. Mizzle just messed up there. Do the same all the way across so then we're not uh having to go back and forth turn them a little bit and then uh oh not that one t that one okay want two Just so we can get a feel how this looks. I think the small one should fit there. I hope so. Oh, did I miss a parking spot? I don't think this was supposed to be a parking spot, guys. No, I'm going to make this a walkway now that this is going into here. That's what that's going to happen now with that space. I might do a mixture, a mixture of uh, some uh, garden plots and uh, yeah. Look at this! Oh my gosh! What's up, chicken? Does this look good? All right, let me uh, let me finish this up. I'm gonna do this off recording. And as well as I want to bring something else in, I don't, we're going to duplicate it, but I think I might try it over here first before we start bringing it over here. Cause I need to figure out the road still over here. All right. Uh, so this will be right back. All right. We're back guys. Uh, I've been busy. Didn't get as far as I want to on the road and stuff, but the road's going this way. Now we got that down. I didn't like the way this was looking as far as a walkway. I just made it to another parking spot and I'm probably going to do the same over here. So still working out the logistics over here, but you ready for this? This is working on some more height and depth. I think that's going to be the title of this video, guys. I'm finally wanting to get, get some of this in. Um, I had this plan more along here and possibly on this side as well. Unless we come up with other structures, because this land is pretty flat right here. We can probably go with another decent sized structure. Not even, oh wow guys, look at that. Yes. Look at that. Now I have to give a, a quick shout out to uh, Queen Surge, because this is where that inspiration came from. 
Um, and then she got inspiration from somebody else, but, but this will put his own little touch on it. Put a little porch over it. I'll take you up there. The, it's only, it's it's uh, faked out, guys. I'm trying to figure it out, and I even though I faked it out, I still messed up. Bizzle has uh, options. I like this. I like how it's kind of narrow, right? We're in this small town. This is what I don't quite like. I might bump it back. I might take it all down. Bump it back. But I added this. Remember, I don't know if you remember from the, the white, all white uh, beach house. I made that indentation. I can't go both or one of these because if I indent this one, I can't indent that one. So it's one or the other. And I, I figured it looked better in front. Same thing on this side is going to have to happen over here in the back. But you can see, it's faked out. So you're probably wondering where did, where did Dizzle mess up? Right there. There's not a piece, unfortunately, for Beachside Boulevard, there isn't a piece that size. So it's either I have to bring this whole structure in one, which if that's the case, it uh, we lose these windows and we got to go with these. The downside with these, they don't have these in white. They only have them in gray. That's one thing I didn't like. So I'm thinking if I move it back, I might move it back two. So then we can at least get one square for this, because that's all I need for up there. And then one square over here. That should make it even with this. I think this is, uh, how many squares is that? A quick look. Yeah, that's three squares. And that's two. I'm right. So I would have to go out two squares to accommodate room one square for there and then one square to add to this front right here. And then that would make actually the porch a little bit bigger. But yeah, that's my own my own little twist on it. And I, did, I went with the brick stairs because, again, I'm trying like this whole more like city vibe more than than a beachy vibe. So I took I didn't. That's why I didn't go with the. Uh, white beachy staircase. I went with the railing. I felt, I felt that was okay, but I didn't want to go with the stairs. And that's why I also went with the gray foundation to make it seem like it's on, on brick. I didn't go with the, actually do have a half wall. And surprisingly, Dizzle didn't use it. You know Dizzle likes to use half walls, but I, I took it out. I had it in, I'm like, just this doesn't look right. I'll put it in over here. Yeah, see? If I was building in Beach, Beachside Boulevard or somewhere else, Maybe I might use it, but I think this looks better sitting on a, on a stone foundation. And then the decision was originally the plan was to build two of these right next to each other. That ain't happening. If it does, I got to move it all the way over, which I don't want to do that. I like this little, little alleyway right here. So I'm probably going to build well, two options, a carport right here. Again, this is, this is all stemming because of the mechanical mayhem update Dizzle started making stuff like with that you could utilize for cars so either a carport here guys and then we just use this for backspace this is their their living space which is kind of stinks though because it's not uh unless we took some of this out how big are these oh yeah we can take some of these out oh for sure for sure for sure yeah yeah, yeah. and we can build a backyard back here right here in this space oh no i can't how far does this go yeah, see, we'd only be able to do part of it. But that's okay. Decisions. Or the other option, I'm sorry. <laughs> the other option is I can build another one, possibly right here, with the front coming out this way. And then we can make this like a little courtyard for the both of them. I would have to do my measurements to see, because now that I got to bump this back two squares, that's going to eat into the space over here. Now that I'm thinking about that. I don't know. I have decisions to make. But there you go. That's the update. Oh, I don't know if I told you guys. I did. I don't think I showed it. I did put the fence back here. Gave it just enough height. I think I might have to go this way too, though. And this way. But I like it. I like this. I don't want to put a fence here. I like this alleyway. The same on that side. Look at this, though. Look at the height now. We're bringing in other structures. I'm loving it. I'm not going to do the white lines down the middle until the very end, guys, because I know eventually we might hit high complexity. Hopefully we don't. We can build this out again because I want to go with more of these this way. I don't know if I mentioned it too. My Another option here is 
usually at the end of these you have uh a place to, to vacuum out your car and i'm thinking maybe building that right here maybe like two stalls with some vacuums in it like something that can represent some vacuums and then i'll put a walkway here so then that tenant can walk down this way and assist over here kind of bring that in because it's kind of just blank over here right now in the back in the front it's fine but in the back see it needs something it needs a wall back there something like this in the back but yeah there you go guys this is the next phase that dizzle after we finish the car wash i know the car wash or maybe, maybe didn't think too much of it <laughs> it didn't do too well in views but i think it's all part of the the vibe that's going on it needed to be done functional or not it all fits in especially now now with that building in there guys and this is this is looking nice yeah but i'll take uh, i'm gonna take lights car out of the uh thumbnail i already have a thumbnail picked out or i took a screenshot i was gonna send it i'm like nope i think the community's gonna have to wait on that one because that's a really nice thumbnail at least i think it is and uh we'll move on to the next step i may or may not have a video for monday guys it is the holiday weekend here um dizzle's been at i think we're at our 110th video this might be our 110th i've been at it straight a video every day ever since i uploaded the first one um three months ago so this one might be taking a break, one day break, and uh, spend some time with family. And then I'll be back at a new video uh, for Tuesday. All right. So if you don't see hear from me on Monday, Dizzle had took a break and spent time with family. And uh, we'll be back the next day, guys. All right. Dizzle, we'll catch you on the next one.